Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to the second episode looking at the all the updates that have happened to Dead Polly recently. Since that last episode, I looked back through. There's been like four updates since like even Halloween. So that's pretty good. And one of the updates added scopes to the game now. So if you go to first person, you can see I don't have any any sights on this gun. So there's we got to look around for some scopes. Got the first person. They also enabled airdrops in that particular one. New dances. Uh, they changed. They did change something with the uh, melee. So that's why I was having a little bit of issues. But we are now currently right here. Last episode, we, we visited this new place, ran all the way up here, so checked out this. Now we're here. So this is the beginning of this new town. Little motel, no tell motel here. We got to find like a military base maybe or something so we can. Uh, so we can find ourselves. Now, I think the sodas actually give you some. Yeah, the sodas will give you some stamina back. I want to find a, a site for this gun. They added sights, and then they had to fix sights, something with the reticle. We're going to go into the town here in a second. Let's hoof it down here real quick. Let's try this first-person mode. Oh, headshot. Headshot. Way easier. I'm not even aiming with that. Just using the reticle. But it's way easier to try and shoot over your shoulder, right? Let's see if this goes. What, what do you guys think the over and under on this going through is? Now, it looked like on the other side is kind of where the, some of those heavy bunkers were. That'd be interesting if you had to go through the bunker to get over here. That would <laughs> take some ammo. Well, it doesn't necessarily look like we're going to be able to make it through here. Okay. Bridge is definitely out. Let's drink this. Get ourselves some stamina back. Well, I can't jump up on there. I don't think you can actually go through here. What I was hoping for was here that we could get through this to here. Uh, let's check the sides real quick. No, it's definitely that that second level on the other side. I don't see a way to get up there from this side, though. What this means is you'd have to go around one of the two ways. They may open it up later, but right now you have to either go down this way and around, which is probably the fastest way if you want to get to this bigger bigger town here. All right, let's go into town. Check it out. The straight ahead of us out there somewhere it looks it, from the map. It looks like an airport. Maybe it's a military airport. That would be pretty cool. Got some decent sized buildings here. A little zombie waiting for us to greet us. A little welcome wagon. Yeah, we kind of need a golf cart. Something, something small. Something that maybe we can put some loot in. Okay. Let's find ourselves a scope. A scope, please. Oh, the dreaded chicken mask in a. That's a juggernaut? I always pictured a juggernaut a little different. I don't know. You never know. Baseball bat, 3D glasses. Okay. All right. We're going to find something. Oh. They know we're here. Okay. Dragon off magazine, AK. I actually have a lot of that stuff. I have a ton of magazines. When I was playing, you could still get a lot of the resources you needed to make bullets they 
did change that soon after I had finished my little playthrough. So it's harder. Ooh, hello, spawn inside. Anybody else want a piece? No, I didn't think so. All right. I would really like to see a scope. Circuit board. AK-30. 30 round AK mag. Staircase is still just a little bit tough to get in. Maybe I put on some weight since I was playing last. All right, apple a day. What is that? Gatorade? Apple juice? Sounds good. Well, here's another little clip. Oh, jeez, that dude's fast. Holy fast, dude. Nurse. All right. They're pretty aggressive. Is this on the map? Where are we? Oh, wait. Oh, that's right. We saw that. That plane crash. We saw all that. We're, we're, oh, right here. Oh, this is where, I, when I started this game, I originally spawned right here. I wonder if that actually goes, it doesn't look like it goes through. Looks like they may be thinking about letting these things go through. Maybe. Maybe you could take your pickaxe to it and dig the whole way. <laughs> that would be a lot of digging. Looks like mm, hospital, maybe? I used to be able to kind of run down. If you run the right way like this, you can kind of see if things are in there. Pills, yeah? Never know. <laughs> oh, shoot. Crawler. Crawler time. Yeah. No more crawling for you. Your crawling days are over, bud. This is a pretty cool city. Pretty cool. Oh, pretty cool. Ooh, I think I have one of those masks. I'll take that. Okay, so it's that person's mask. Could there be any more consonants and vowels in there? <laughs> this is like the house I originally lived in back in the other area. A little diner action. Here's two of the. Oh, <gasps> shoot. These guys are super fast, man. How fast are those dudes? Use. What does this give me? 25. Oh. Oh, shoot. All right. Um, they definitely increase the speed of some of these guys, making it much more challenging. You got to really keep your, uh, your wits about you. Oh, it's the... Uh, I don't want to die via hot dog, man. Not the hot dog. I think we'll use one of these. So you have to hit X to cancel if you're in the middle of doing something like that, which I did kind of forget about. Go check these three buildings here real quick. I, I would like just to go up in the tall buildings to see if they're, like... If there's loot, if it's like they said, there's loot, but there's no, um, am I crouched? I felt like I was crouched. No, like, furniture, which is fine by me. Oh, I did not want to pick that up. I didn't want to pick that up. I wanted to look in it. All right, man. We're gonna glance in these real quick. These are kind of like buildings that are around my house. There's pizza in that one. I mean, who doesn't like pizza straight off the floor? I do. The five second rule, right? It applies, all right, got that. Let's go check out some of these taller ones over here. Now, there's two different style of tall buildings. One I liked, one not so much. 
one made it real easy to yeah this is a good one see it's real easy to kind of see each floor but what you got to check is they were putting stuff out here to keep you honest so it's really was it like just flash up to here oh a rocket dude what what do you do with the rocket is it just a decoration Rocket in your pocket. The rocket was the loot of this building. Some 50 cal. And gunpowder. I really want to see one of these scopes. Maybe we need to find a... No, I don't think we need to find a, a military thing. Nothing in our crate. Hello, I am our crate. Nice to meet... Is that toilet paper? Oh, look at this. A small table on the... Right in my way. Okay, not anymore. Oh! Alright, we got ourselves some pliers. Got a nice view from up here. We, I had to run all that way to there. See if there's anything on that one. Would you take the chance to try and jump across here? No, I don't think so. So, okay, the airport. Oh, the airport looks cool. Now, it looks like from here that there is a fence. Something here. Definitely looks like you need to follow the road in. There looks like some kind of fence along there. I can see, just see. Gives you a really good look at the buildings, though. So to get, so to get there, we need to go to that town and then to there. I want to, I want to see that place. That that looks really cool. Gas mask. All right, let's get out of this building. We don't need to go up in the other tall building. I just wanted to check out at least one of them. Yeah. This gets me dizzy. I always get dizzy coming down. I remember they fixed the they had like weeds coming through the staircases. They fixed that a long they fixed that a long time ago, but it doesn't feel like you get hung up as much on these stairs. I used to have to I used to walk yeah, see how you can walk this ledge? You can end up walking that ledge a lot. Oh I'm getting dizzy. Alright. Diner time. Apple, banana. Oh, pumpkin. Pumpkins are always good. Yeah. 50, 50 uh, food, 10 water, and three, 3 bites at the old apple. This town's pretty cool, too. I like it. It feels, it's like, feels big because it's open with a lot of big buildings. Now, let's see. That guy used to always carry money. To do with his pants to oh what do you know what do you know money it is kind of want to see i'm i'm actually want to see that airport i always like airports in these games i don't know why oh underground is this small underground yeah small underground but an underground nonetheless where's my golf cart city hall mm. where's the police station that might have a a scope in it firearm sign no firearms in city hall can we push the buto can we push the buto i said all right we're we're hoofing it we're going now, i don't know if you can actually run up this hill right here we're gonna try it out See if this, if they prevent you, well, they don't prevent you via uh, elevation change. See how you can kind of see a, like what looks like a fence there? If it is, we'll just walk along. If it's not, we'll breach it and go straight to the airport. Maybe there's a, oh, it looks like a possible break in the fence over here. Nope, it's spawning in. No, it looks like there could be some damage there. Is that a dirt? Right here. 
Oh yeah. Look at that dirt V. Like somebody drove a vehicle through there. Shortcut time. Two vehicles. There's a car there and there's something else here. A Volkswagen bus or something. But that that's a pretty heavily guarded airport. Look at this fence. They keep people in and out. Oh, it was like a Vanagon. <laughs> Called that. I was making it up. All right. There might be some really bad people over here. Looks like it could be a military base. Oh, it is. All you have to do to make it the difference between an airport and a military base, put big C1. My goodness, look at those big planes. Put the big planes in. Make things green. Oh, no. You know what I just thought of? These are the guys from the bunker. Right? These are going to be the bunker dudes. Uh, that guy's from World War II, apparently. You know the crazy military dudes that come out of the bunker? That thing's been blown up. Crawley. She was walking. She's faking it. Look at these planes. It's like a C-130 Hercules over there. Wide body. All right. So where would we find delicious stuff? Let's check this thing here. This, this here is definitely cool. You know why? Because if the things in the bunker always had the best loot, right? Guns, bullets, magazines, all that kind of stuff. You could theoretically... If that's the case, build your house out here somewhere. Then you could loot this little place, still loot this place, but farm this place. It's kind of locked in. Oh, there we go. I couldn't scroll out anymore. But you could farm this place. Like, you want to farm that best stuff, right? I got a million guns, but it doesn't mean I don't need a million more. See, look, there's random ammo laying on the ground. A 955. 556 armor piercing. Okay. Oh, we can't climb ladders in this. Okay. So it's at the. Oh, that dude is really fast. Let's go look at the planes then. Maybe there's a bunker here. Hidden back in here somewhere. Where's the bunker? These guys here are fast, and they take a lot of bullets to kill. At least they used to. Look at that guy. Okay, apparently he's scared of the old M4. Don't mind if I do. I hit that dude twice, and he's like, ah, needs garlic. Wow, this place is actually big. They got, like, uh, barracks back there. Maybe we can escape escape the apocalypse here. No. What if you got caught in here by one of those big dudes? You know the big Ophi fools? You know what I'm talking about. All right, let's uh let's get some apple juice in our system. Oh, it did a little food and water. It looked like it may have given us some stamina too. I didn't double check that, but They're not really guarding me very well. Oh, some 54R, nice military helmet. This is a ground look like it's camouflaged. Oh, by the way, look at my, can you see? Was there a way to turn around? No. See my pants are like blue camo? I hit the O button. No pants. It's like changing the color of my stuff. Oh, there's brown camo. It's like uh, multi-cam Marine Corps. No pants. Track suit. There we go. So that would be in here in the clothes coming soon. But you can just hit the O button to change what, you, what you're wearing. Pretty cool. 
Oh, what's this? Ventilation to a bunker. Look at little civilian parking lot here. Oh, we better go check back there. That looks like something interesting. This base, I think this base is probably the coolest thing I've seen. I like this. There could be a bunker back here. It could be like a shooting, ooh, could be a shooting range. Are they all rocking car 98s? This looks like a, oh, auto saving. Don't do anything till save is complete. Don't be in the middle of a fight during an autosave. All right, we've got some 5.56, M955, little AKM. I've got a couple of those already. It's a shooting range. That's why there's bullets everywhere. Pretty cool. Somebody just left their AK there. Oh, look at it. Looks like there's a fair amount of loot in those blimp hangers. 7.62. Oh, nice helmet. I'm still looking for a scopey. All right, looking for a scope still for my gun. Red dot, whatever, magnified, I don't care. I'm not picky. Good ammo, like I said, ammo's harder to make, so you get a place where you can start, you can farm and collect ammo. A little basketball court, more of those, some of those Kwanzaa huts down there. Let's check out what's in here. Besides this dude. Oh, G36C. I have eight bullets left on me, or in my gun. Helmet, vest, vest. Cooking pot? Raid, oh, it's the raid helmet. Dude. I wanna put that on. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I got the raid helmet on now. Nobody's going to mess with me. Neener, neener, neener. Oh, this one's locked. I don't see a lot of stuff in that one. Maybe it hasn't spawned yet. Oh, a little locked door action. What is this? The old Area 51 Skunk Works action. I knew that was going to happen. Okay. So I could not reload there. When I, whilst sprinting. Very interesting. I thought I was going to die. I thought I was going to die. I want to see what all these little... I want to see what those places have. Those look like maybe more important people live in there. Oh, what's that? A PU scope. Okay, so traditionally, traditionally a PU scope would be for a Russian gun, not, not for like an AK type of thing, not necessarily an M4, but it does not mean that you cannot try and modify it. Attachments. Where's that PU scope at? Oh, right there. Nope. Sniper rifle. It's a sniper scope. I have sniper rifles back at the house. Another suppressor. Okay. Some of that. That guy's on duty down there. Vector, we've got a few vectors in our lives. Give us a scope I can put on my M4, please. 
Oh, they did not. They weren't like stingy with the bullets on the ground. I like that. And this is exactly where they should be, right? At the military base. Let's see, I think it was B. Okay, so B is single shot or auto. I like single shot because it has some vertical recoil. And you end up wasting bullets. Just, I just like running on semi-auto. Now there was a couple of jet fighters over here. Maybe we could fly. Oh, right there. We could fly that sucker out of here, dude. Right to freedom. Yeah, much better with uh, semi-auto. Another vector. Bullets. Bullets. What is that one? The orange apocalyptic vest. Okay, looking good. Wow, there's even more over there. This place is pretty big. So some stuff did spawn in here now. It's like two guns. M4, M4. Getting a lot of those 50 Action Express bullets. And a fair amount of armor piercers. That's M855. That's a standard one right there. What do we got here? So these are the armor piercing. We've got 28 of those. And then 12 of those. Let's put these... In here. There we go. Did that guy run by me and not? Okay. All right. I ain't crying. Well, this is one of the secret ones that have been blown open. Vests. They got some cool vests in here. Oh, jeez. See? Semi-auto. Uh, the best. Oh, FAMAS and AK-203. Later. All right, let's fly this bad boy. You know you you know you want to let me in. Dude, that thing is awesome looking. Oh. Russian American. Russian United States. That's what those two fighters are. That guy's looking at me weird. Not sure I trust him. Should you trust it? See, more 50s. Some 855s. Green tips. More 50s. Okay, he had friends, apparently. This place is awesome. I don't know. I don't remember how often the loot respawns, but you could farm the heck out of this place, right? While you're doing other things, maybe building your house and M4. I did find a scope, but it's for a sniper rifle, which I don't have with me right now. I guess if we... I'm thinking that, like, from this position, you'll be able to look through the scope from that first-person position. Do, 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 do. Another raid helmet, a riot helmet. They need to turn some lights on in that one. Ooh, nice vests. It's dark in here. 762 50 Action Express. You think I got a deagle laying in my pocket? Hmm. You know, when it's dark, though, it's actually easier to see the bullets on the ground. Another air vent thingy. I I would imagine they have a bunker here somewhere. I just didn't see it. Maybe. Maybe not. All right, let's try and see if there's anything at the tower. Well, I'm getting hungry and thirsty. Wasn't even checking on that. All right. We got ourselves an AKM. 
and a fair amount of bullets. All right, tower, please. Maybe the tower is where the bunker is. Okay. Nine by nineteens. Can we get in this bad boy? No ladder time. Helmet out back. Some debris. Oh, look, a plane crashed into. <laughs> Whoops, a daisy. Wave off. Wave off. Dang, plane went through the tower. That's why it's not here anymore. Doesn't look like there's anything in there anyway. Dude, I, I think this base is pretty darn cool. It'd be cool if you could climb ladders and get up into those things, but I don't think you can actually climb ladders in here. See, without a scope, I can't really even aim. I, the aiming red will call Oh, get on, sucker. Oh, why did I reload that? Did not want to reload that. All right, we need some delicious food. Tasty and delicious. Maybe one water. Maybe one water. I like the upgrades that they've done. I can see, I can see like, uh, you know, like when you look down the road, where how the game is developing. I can see with the how this is kind of spread out, right? Interconnecting roads. I could see a, a golf cart in our future or something like that. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Now that other town, the only one we haven't looked at is, well, actually it's not the only one. There was, I don't know why it's doing that. Yeah, it is the only one, yeah. We looked at this one, this one, this one, this one. We gotta go check this out real quick. My map was freaking out. So apparently they added the map in a while ago as well. And it was after I had played last, so. Are you okay, friend? Uh, you okay, little buddy? I actually want to re-equip that. Attachments. Take that off and re-equip this one. I don't know why I reloaded. I had 22 bullets left in it. 22 bullets! Wait, where's the road? Road's over there? Oh, the road comes out of the parking lot. Well, that makes sense. I just noticed there's a caution sign on the back of my vest, like probably armor. Armor time? See, you could live out here, in between here, or even a little bit close to that bigger town if you wanted to farm. I'm trying to remember. I, I, they may have updated the, the, respawn, uh, the loot respawn, but wasn't it every morning? Like every day the stuff respawned? The next day? I think so, maybe. Maybe. That would be... That would be pretty good. Worth, uh... Farming. Got a diner. Every town needs a diner, right? Every town needs a diner. Mm-hmm. Every town needs a diner. Oh, yeah. And every diner needs some bullets in it. That dude needs to pull his pants up. See if he's got cash on him. Yep. Cash it is. They throw their zombie voices pretty good. Ooh. No, I heard somebody. What's up, Spike? That's a cool looking set of buildings down there. Oh, it's Guns' building. What? It's pink. Has his pants off. Does he have cash on him? Every time, you guys, the pants down guys are the cash carriers. Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. I like this. So if you guys were a uh, modified axe, that looked like a two-piece axe. 
So if you guys watched my playthrough before, you knew it was just that one small area, and what... Like what Guns said, he got bored of just uh, looting and looting and looting the same areas. Like he was kept running through kind of the same buildings and stuff. So he got a little bored of that. But with the expansion of this and now obviously you're going to they're going to probably work on zombie spawns. And it, I did read something in there about like events that they're working on, possibly like um, the coolest thing is when you're pretty well equipped right now. And you, you take on a bunker, right? Because the harder dudes come out, they're constantly chasing you. It's a battle. So if they could work on an event, maybe, you know, in, in when you're in town, maybe it's nightfall, maybe it's a, a bomb drop, something explodes. There was that one town. Hmm. Yeah. Events could be cool because you want that next level type of battle you don't want to just have to go to the bunker for the really big battles even though every one of these fools that came up to you when i went to melee them my gosh it was way harder to make what what about first person melee that doesn't look like it'd be any actually i tried to hit that one guy and it was missing i think they did it for multiplayer because it said i did read it said I thought it, I'm, I'm trying to see. I have it on my other screen. It might not be this one. Scopes. You can now sleep in beds and tents. You couldn't sleep before. You We had to wait through the night when we were doing the playthrough. We had to wait. Now you can sleep in beds. High quality workbench now is 1500 limit. Cargo. Significant changes to how melee attacks function. In multiplayer, which may have also affected this. I mean, this is single player here. But maybe they did. I don't know. It, it usually that's what usually happens. I'm I'm not saying this is what happened here, but usually, when there's a multiplayer aspect of a game, the people in multiplayer will cry and complain about something, and then the developers changes changes it and it ruins it for single player or co-op like it a pvp element will get changed because people cry about it and it changes the pve element as well and that's an issue it happened a lot in seven days to die it happened in rust you know games like that the pvp guys the pvp people would would cry I love saying cry. Cry about something, right? Seven days, I remember, they cried about rocket launchers. They cried about shotguns. And since then, rocket launchers and shotguns suck in those games, right? You used to be able to take down a building with a rocket launcher in seven days. Now you can't even dig a hole to take a pee in. You know what I'm saying? So here's that other town. Now, we went through this town when it first dropped. This was the last time we played. It was pretty empty, though. It just dropped, and there was nothing in there, like no loot. Now that they put in this loot thing, it may not have uh, furniture in, but it, it'll have loot in it, which is cool. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this one. I wanted to jump back in here. I saw it had an update. When I read the update and then looked, came in here and looked at this, I'm like, oh, we got to run around, at least check those places out. It's pretty cool. It's pretty, pretty cool. Anyway, you guys, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for joining me along, checking this thing out. See you guys next episode.